okay, no, I'm not accepted. I'm just shortlisted, but that's the first step. So the good thing about ESSEC is that everything um, happens online, so you can apply online. You just have to scan the documents and then upload them on the site. So it's really simple, it's really easy, so you don't have to, to, you don't have to worry about that. I'd say that uh, um, having extracurriculars, at least a few, is important. I mean, if you have great grades, that's one thing, but being, I feel like being a real person who's done things and has passion is really important for being a student at this school. I think um, the motivation letter is really important because you have to show them why you are a good candidate and why you are um, motivated to study at ESSEC. I think the most important part about an application is just being yourself and putting yourself on paper. It's like how, who you feel you are, should reflect uh, should be reflected on the paper that you submit to ESSEC. Any teacher that knows you well as a person, not just as a student, uh, is probably a great person to get a recommendation letter from, or maybe even a coach for a sports team. Ask the teachers that knew me well personally, but that also observed me during class and could really assess my skills. I personally went to one of my favorite teachers who like knew me well as a person because then they could, uh, I feel, more accurately describe who I am. Tips I would have to anyone preparing for the interview would be connect to Skype 10 minutes or 15 minutes prior to the interview so you know everything's working fine. Uh, going into the interview, first of all be well dressed and like prepare the area that you're going to have the interview as well. That's, I, f I feel like that should be one of the most important things. And then before going to the interview, review your CV that you submitted because they will ask you directly questions about that as well as like personal interests. To prepare for the Skype interview, they could actually think about potential questions that the interviewers might ask them. And then I just think that um, it's very important to not stress. Don't be stressed during the interview. Just be, <laughs> just be natural. And sometimes they might ask you some challenging questions, but just take your time to answer and be natural and always remember that no one is you and that is your power. I would say definitely still try apply because it's more than just about grades in ESSEC, I believe. I think it's more as well including like what type of person you are, how, like how expressive you are and what you do outside of class as well, just as much as your grades. I definitely think that these students should apply even if they don't have excellent grades because um, one very important thing is also the potential that they see in students. So even if you do not have excellent grades, maybe you still have the potential to actually be a really, really good um, student as, at ESSEC. So I think you should definitely give it a try and just try to do as well as possible in other aspects such as the motivation letter, your essay and the interview. Because if they see potential in you during the interview, you might still get accepted. Welcome to ESSEC. Common and ESSEC. The comments of ESSEC. Καλωσορίσατε στο ESSEC.